Good day! In this video, we are going to try and solve question 5 of the 2025 Term 2, Week 2 NCA exam titled the Numeracy exam, also called the CA exam, is titled Apply Maths and Stats in a Range of Everyday Situation. This is a level 1 unit standard. It means that you either get achieved or not achieved. In order to get achieved, you need to fulfill three outcome one two and three so if you can fulfill certain numbers of outcome in this paper itself then you will get achieved so without further ado let's do question 5a so first and quite 5a sounds like this okay so this uh, calculation type of question so we shall read a mother seal is 1.68 meter long and the newborn pup is 0 0.48 so how many times longer is the mother seal than her pup so we need to calculate the mother seal is 1.68, the seal pup is 0 0.48 meters. And to know how long it is the mother to the pup, you just take 1.68 divided by 0 0.48. I've done before, is 3.5 times. Okay, so if you can put 3.5, you will get outcome number two. Now we shall do question 5b. So question 5b sounds like this. Okay. So Seals must eat between 4 and 6% of their body weight in food every day. The seal weighs 148 kilograms. What is the minimum amount of food the seal must eat each day? So they must eat between 4 to 6 because they ask for minimum. We are going to calculate 4 instead of 6. 4% 4 of its body weight which is 148 kg. So what we're we going to do, we just take 4% is 4 over 100, multiply off in mathematics, multiply by 148, and the last step you are going to put in your calculator, and I've done beforehand, it's going to be 5.92 kg, and we're going to put the answer here, 5.92 kg, and that is going to be again outcome number 2. Not too bad, right? Great, now we shall do question 5c 5c sounds like this okay so so you can't see uh just bear with me i'm going to read the question places where seals can be found are shown on the letters on the map so that they found in a b uh c d e f okay so they say the question is where can seals be found at 50.3 south and 167a so south is there okay so south is on the bottom here 50.3 is around here somewhere down below the 15.5 point slightly down so most likely this point and we confirm 167 is this 165 so 167 slightly more so that is the east so the answer is going to be a outcome the the position is a if you get it right that is outcome number one okay that is map reading hopefully you know how to read a map Okay, now we shall do part D, question 5D. So it sounds like this. The number of lines shows the depth dived by a New Zealand fur seal. Okay, seals are excellent divers. Estimate the depth the fur seal dive to. So you can see this divided into five parts is 500 meters, this zero, so one, two, three, four, five. So every line is 100 meter. So he, he dive between 100 and 200. So I would safely say it is going to be 150 meters below the sea level. Okay. So in fact, the answer is anything from 145 to 155 meters below sea level will be accepted. So again, this is outcome number two. Great. Now we are nearly there. Now we have two more questions to go and we'll finish the whole exam. Okay, so there's a, okay, the paper stuck. So we shall try to get rid of the... Yes, we got it there. Okay, this is a argument type of question, justification. So this will be outcome three generally. Okay, the graph show the kind of food seals eat at different times of the year. The different colored bars shows different half of the year. So you can see the blue is the autumn and winter and in spring and summer is going to be the yellow. Okay. So they say in autumn and winter seals eat mostly squids, mackerel and hockey. Do you agree with the statement? So we are only looking at the blue bar. Okay. Because we're talking about autumn and spring. So looking at the blue bar, the seals eat about 17% of squid. Squid 17%. 
Then 24% of mackerel, which is here, 25, slightly below 25, with 24% mackerel. And hockey is 31%. So you add up 17, 24, and 31, it's about more or less around 70%. So we have to agree. So you need you must answer that you agree that in autumn and winter, the seals eat mostly squid, mackerel, and hockey. The other food we made up of octopus, anchovy, pilchard, and eel will make up the other 30%. So if you can answer this, this is outcome number three. And we shall proceed to the last question of this internal. Okay, so the last question of the unit standard sounds like this. Okay, so we shall read that. Okay, the dot on the map shows how where the seal is located in a place called Ohau Point. Okay, Ohau Point is a yellow map here. Ohau Point is a yellow star. The white dot shows where the seal swims to. So you're going to swim from here to here. So they ask you to estimate how far is this point to this point, and they give you the scale here to here is 100 kilometer. So here to here the 100 kilometer. I put it up there. It's about the same 100 kilometer. So I would put there 100 kilometer. In fact, the answers in the marking schedule says anything from 85 to 105 kilometer is acceptable. So when you have a ruler, make sure you measure them. It is around 85 to 105 kilometer. So you get that right. It's outcome number one. So we have completed all the five questions. So for question five itself, outcome two happens at question 5a, 5b, and 5d. Outcome one occurs at 5c and 5f and outcome 3 occurs in 5e. So hopefully you go through everything again and ace the exam and make sure you pass once and for all and you don't have to do numeracy for the rest of your life. Cheers everyone, have a great day and I wish you all the best.